Hey guys, it's Silver Zero Breaks here. Just want to say welcome back to my channel. And today we are breaking open the 2019 2020 Upper Deck Ice. So, yes, we are revisiting this particular product because initially, when I grabbed this box out of the closet, I was thinking, you know what? This particular product has skyrocketed in price. It's no longer, you know, the mid tier sort of pricing anymore. And uh, given how expensive it is, it would have been a nice sort of 1,000 subscriber giveaway. But, you know, according to this little poll that I post up on Instagram, the majority actually wants me to open this up rather than to give it away. So here I am opening this particular product up. Um, there's not much I'm chasing from this particular set because there's, it's not very ducks heavy. And I pretty much got most of the ducks cards I wanted. Um, there is that potential of a super script or superb script of Troy Terry which I would like to get, but that one seems fairly hard to uh, obtain. But I do get, uh, I did get all the uh, Max Jones cards that I wanted out of here, including the Sub-Zero. So I do have some nice little Max Jones features in the background, including a very nice gold, exquisite rookie, number two, uh, 19, right there. So there we go. Um, but yeah, here we go, Upper Deck Ice. There's uh, five cards per pack, five packs per box. They shrunk the product a little bit, so it looks fairly tiny. So uh, yeah, hopefully something good out of here. The corner's a little dinged up, but um, as long as the inside contents are fine, I ain't gonna complain. So there we go. Time to crack open into this product. I actually picked this up from a hobby shop here in Australia and uh, hockey's not all that popular. So when I actually walked into the shop and said, oh, can I buy a box of Upper Deck Ice? The guy just had this deer in the headlights look on his face. And he's like, what's that? I'm like, oh, uh, a hockey card product. And then his coworker then knew what it was and went to grab it, or not to grab it, to point out where it was. But uh, yeah, so there we go. We got our five packs right over here. It feels a bit heavy, so hopefully something good will be in here. Uh, but yeah, that's my experience buying Upper Deck Ice from Australia, so there you go. I'll leave uh, the box in the background. Actually, no, I'll probably put it just down right over here. So you can still see Mr. Carey Price. And I'll have these packs good to go. So pack number one, let the break begin. Of course, I should remember that uh, the packs aren't as easy to open anymore. Oh, geez, that is uh, that did not end up very well. Uh, let's say we got an ice premiere in one of these. So let's have a look to see what's in here. And we have a base card of Sidney Crosby. Congratulations for reaching the thousand game milestone. We have a, a green Mitch Mani. Got decoy. Oh, that was rather unimpressive. The decoy landed on one of my floor mats. Anyway, we got a uh, ice premiere of Scott Sabrin. Not exactly the one I'm after, but there you go. Scott Sabrin ice premiere, number to twelve ninety nine. So it's very hard to hit those level one ice premieres. Like there's less than one percent chance of doing so. Uh, but anyway, we have a base card of Matthew Kachuk and a base card of Philippe Forsberg. So there we go. Pack number two. Still hoping for something nice in here. And I'm not sure what's in here. But anyway, let's have a look. We have Natty Mac, Blake Wheeler. We got a green Elias Pedersen. Decoy. Oh, nice. We got an ice premiere of Dominic Kubalik. This one's numbered to 249. So he's actually not a level one ice premiere, surprisingly, but Dominic Kubalik is a very solid player. So I'm super happy with that. That is awesome. Finally, I get a pretty good ice premiere rookie out of here. All right. And then we have a base card of Carey Price. So we're supposed to get one hard sign autograph and one memorabilia card, and we have hit neither. So pack number three, well, we finally get some magic in here. Oh, this is not easy to open, there we go. And from the massive curve, you know it's gonna be one of those Ice Premier Jersey cards like this one here. Notice the curve? I've been trying to flatten this for months, it's not happening. But anyway, <laughs> all right, we got uh, Jacob Truba, Jonathan Taves, we got an orange, Sidney Crosby. And we have an ice premiere jersey of Taro Hirose. So 
So there we go. Taro Hiroshi stunned the box break of 1920 without this guy. So there we go. And notice the jersey doesn't even really fit all the way to the window. There's like a tiny little white gap across the top right there. So uh, yeah, cutting it very fine and it's curved. So there we go. And we have a base card of Rasmus Dahlin to finish that off. Two packs to go. I don't know. This one feels a little bit heavier, so I might save that for later. And we'll go through this one first. And looks like we got our decoy in here. So we have Claude Giroux, Brady Kachuk, a green Jonathan Huberto. Oh, there we go. We got a Sub-Zero Auto of Carson Kuhlman. So I'm not sure what's in that one because the other one feels heavy. So there we go, a Sub-Zero Auto of Carson Kuhlman. I love this the look of this card. It's super shiny. It's great. Um, I know they're no longer acetate cards for the Sub-Zero ones, but still very nice looking. So there you go. Again, not exactly the rookie I'm after, but you know what? Still nice. Decoy. And we have Tyler Sagan. So last pack, Mojo. Maybe if I'm lucky, something really good out of here. Because it did feel a bit heavy. So, oh yeah, there's a bit of a thick card in there. So probably one of those exquisite rookies. It's looking like one of those exquisite rookies, right? It's a super, super, th check it out. It is thick. All right, we got a thick boy today. All right, we have Jordan Bennington, Seth Jones, Austin Matthews. We've got a green Anze Kopitar. I'm thinking this is one of those exquisite rookies. It's looking like it. That looks like the Superman. We got the Superman. We have an exquisite rookie of Ilya Mikheyev, numbered 109 of 399. So there we go. Still a very nice card. I wish this one was the autograph card, but uh, that would have been kind of cool because I am a fan of Ilya Mikheyev. Very smart guy. And a pretty good player too. So there we go. Ilya Mikheyev exquisite rookies. So all in all, nothing mind blowing, but there was a really good ice premiere out of here. So anyway, just a quick recap of the hits in this box. We did get a jersey of Taro Hiroshi. We got the exquisite rookie of Ilya Mikheyev. And we got a uh, ice premiere of Scott Sabrin. This one's really good. Uh, we got a nice premiere of Dominic Kubelik. And lastly, we have the autograph, which is the Sub-Zero Auto of Carlson Kuhlman. There we go. So that is it for this box of Upper Deck Ice. Let me know what you thought of this in the comments down below. Um, yeah, so I guess it, you guys made the good choice of getting me to open this up instead. <laughs> but anyway, um, so yeah. Uh, thank you guys once again for taking time to check out the video. I really do appreciate your support. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to get 10,000 subscribers, so hopefully we'll get there someday. Um, so yeah, like, comment, subscribe, you know, you know what to do. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are doing well and you're staying safe out there and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye.